inventory replenishment. Acumatica tools allow you to minimize inventory holding costs while reducing the chances of an out-of-stock event. Real-time reports and automated processes reduce ordering and management costs associated with stocking inventory. When I log into Acumatica as an inventory manager, I immediately see items that I need to purchase, as well as inventory that I should consider replenishing. I can drill down to see the screen where my purchase order requests are maintained. POs can originate from special orders, back orders, and replenishment recommendations. These sources are aggregated so they can be reviewed on a single screen. If one vendor can fill multiple requests, a single purchase order is created. Now let's take a step back and see how items on this screen were created. On the sales order screen, each line item can indicate that a purchase order needs to be created. An open sales order that specifies a purchase order automatically creates a new purchase request. These items are immediately available to the purchasing manager for approval and processing. For critical items, an email alert can be sent to the purchasing manager. Inventory replenishment can also drive purchase orders. In the Inventory Management module, I define replenishment settings for each inventory class and inventory item. I can select seasonal preferences to align my inventory holding quantities with expected product demand, taking into account past sales as well as future marketing campaigns. Acumatica allows me to select two replenishment methods, min-max and fixed reorder quantity. The min-max algorithm calculates an order quantity based upon the difference between the minimum and maximum quantity specified, minus the amount on hand. The fixed reorder quantity allows me to calculate an economic order quantity based on factors that are specific to my business and vendors. By switching to the Vendor Details tab, I can enter or change the reorder settings associated with a vendor and select a preferred vendor. To simplify management of this process, Acumatica includes demand planning algorithms to recommend changes based on past sales. Demand planning uses completed sales over a period of time to recommend changes to the replenishment parameters. Recommendations appear on the Calculate Replenishment Parameters screen. After reviewing these recommendations, the Apply Replenishment Parameters screen allows me to update the values. When I am ready to generate requests, I go to the Prepare Replenishment screen to review the list of items that require replenishment. I can run this process manually or set it to run at a scheduled interval. When I process replenishment, the system generates a request for the purchasing manager who can place an order to get more items. This can be accomplished by manufacturing the goods, transferring items from another warehouse, or creating a purchase order. In this case, I will create a purchase order that covers multiple requests that I can review and approve. Once initiated, the purchase order follows my standard approval process defined in my purchase order approval map. By using Acumatica, I can monitor inventory levels in real time across multiple warehouses. This simplifies the process of creating orders and reduces paperwork. By optimizing inventory, I can lower carrying costs, reduce waste, improve customer service by eliminating out-of-stock scenarios, and minimize ordering hassles. For more information about Acumatica, visit our website to read documentation and view other videos.